Investigation a month ago, we told you about an Omaha senior citizen who paid thousands of dollars for a badly needed roof, but the contractor took her money and didn't come back. The story touched many in the roofing industry, and Mike McKnight shows us the results. They're going to take off some of the bad decking right there. After feeling ripped off 10 months ago, 89-year-old Roberta Casey watches her roof being torn off by three companies doing the job for free. I'm so grateful. I don't even know words can't uh, express it. It was so important. I couldn't do it. In January, Roberta paid Fred's Home Improvements $5,000, she says, with no work ever started. It breaks our heart that this happens, oh, so uh, we step, wanted to step up right away and make sure. Tom Stibbs with GW Contracting brought in a crew to tear off the old shingles and replace bad decking. Oh, she totally needed it. But also take a look at the condition of the chimney that had to be rebuilt. It's going to make it safer. Repairs that after almost a year will finally give Roberta a solid roof over her head. No more leaks. Leaks are going to be no gone. No more leaks. No. Good. I can take the buckets away. <laughs> the bucket can go away after yeah, today. ABC Supply and IKO Shingles donated all the roofing materials to get the job done right. And besides plugging the leaks, all this donated material and free labor will make life not only more comfortable, but affordable for Roberta in the future. The improvements up above will make the heating and air conditioning bills go down. All the way across this, this eave is gonna be cut out to make room for what's called deck air. It's gonna make a huge difference on our monthly um, bills. She's going to see them decrease drastically. GW Contracting found that the senior citizen homeowner had problems beyond her roof and installed a $7,000 heating and air conditioning system for free. It was so hot in there, so we made sure last week we got the air going in there for her. Can't believe this is happening. Roberta Casey says what's really cool is that three companies came together to donate so much to not only restore her home, but also her trust in contractors. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> On your side near 30th and Fort, Mike McKnight, 6 News. Well, what a great outcome. The cost of the new roof is about $22,000. The workers did it for free. The homeowner is also starting to get a refund from the original contractor who never started uh, the, the work. Fred's Home Improvements deposited $500 in her account and promised to eventually pay off the remaining $4,500.